We even sympathize with people who commit zina. I'll give you a simple example. Okay. And, uh, and I, this is an example actually that I heard uh, from one of the scholars and uh, it's not a personal example or anything like that. But he said that if you're watching a movie where the theme has something to do with fornication, with zina, you might find yourself taking the side of the zani. Let me describe a scenario. The scenario in the movie is that there is a young girl and she's in love with this young guy and they love each other very much and then they commit zina with each other then the father who is strict an evil man even though he's the right the, the good person he should be the good guy in the movie but the director makes him the bad guy he discovers that she's committing zina with this boy and he forbids her from seeing him so there is a scene now this is all hypothetical where the father is sleeping and she's going to run away with her boyfriend forever and they can live a life of zina and so she creeps into his room and she's trying to get the keys as you're watching this scene, whose side are you on? I'm telling you, even the righteous people, they would watch this scene and they won't say, Inshallah, he wakes up. Ya Allah, make him wake up and beat her. You'll be on her side. The key clinkles and he goes, <coughs> turn around and you hope he doesn't wake up. Why not? Let him wake up and beat her up with his slippers. She's committing zina. And he is the right person. His daughter is committing zina. He has ghira. But no, we're on the side now of the zunat, we're watching him, I hope he doesn't wake up, we'll get the keys, okay, just gotta get out of the door, you did it girl, now you can commit zina. What do you think? So be, we've become used to it. People, if there's anything you take away from this lecture, hate zina. And when you hate zina, you can't watch sitcoms. And the whole episode is about this guy and that guy and this happened by mistake and they committed zina and then the whole episode is about the gossip related to the zina and you're just laughing with the laugh track. And is this what Allah created you for? To sit, listen to stories about zina and laugh with a laugh track which is more embarrassing. It's a fake laugh track and you laugh. <laughs> What's the matter with you? It's all this. Anyways, but <laughs> and it really... I would like us to take away from this lecture the hatred for zina in our hearts. Don't ever let it pass by just like drinking water.